a child in many ways is an impression of all the adults who impact his life, particularly the parents, teachers and others. If you want your children to be of a certain quality, the foremost thing that you need to pay attention to is, are you exuding that quality? What endears a child to everyone is that he's an exuberant life and a bundle of joy most of the time, <laughs> unless you cause misery to him. If you want to nurture a child, you must be far more exuberant than the child and much more joyful, then the child is drawn to you. Once the child is drawn to you, it's for you to mold the child as you want. Right now, most children avoid adults because most of them are not exuberant by any standards, neither joyful, mostly stressed and complaining about their work, about their family, about the world, about everything. Why would a child want to have anything to do with you? When child sees you don't represent life, you represent some other vested interest. If you are interested, in really being an impact on your children, you must represent life because they are just life. They have not become other conceited things as you could have. They are simply life. You must represent life. Feeding upon so-called inanimate things like food, water and air, life is an exuberant expression of existence. If you do not represent that exuberance. If you do not show that exuberance in your work, in your relaxation, in everything that you do and do not do, then your child will be least impacted by you. And that is a good thing. Because if you're so dead serious about your life and you represent other vested interests of your money or your status or your prestige or something like this, then it is best that the child is not impacted by these things. So if you are really concerned about impacting your child, what is it that your child want to be? Please become that to start with.